but we're not here to tell ranchers how to change the way they do things. I wouldn't begin to do that. Uh, what we're here to do is help them tell their story. Our family's chosen that we want to be ranchers. We don't want to be dude ranchers, we want to be ranchers. So we're really trying to find a way to hone our, our beef production and raise our value so that we can provide a good living for our families that are here. We've always been, had our beef kind of taken away from us at a lower price and thrown in with other beef. And what we're doing is saying, our beef's better, pay us, pay us the premium that our beef's worth. We don't know really where our Wyoming beef is going after it leaves the state. And we should know that. And people want to know that because they know Wyoming beef is the best in the country. What we're really doing is tracking the, the care that they give their animals along that process. Where they were, how they were handled what's happened with them, uh, any vaccines they may have had. How is this beef getting from the pasture to your table? You know, we already put an ear tag in our calves. This puts a second ear tag into it. Uh, there's gonna be a, a bookkeeping component of it. Blockchain enables us to sort of track that throughout the life of the cow until potentially it gets on your table. I'm excited because it feels like work that I've been doing in the greater world is coming home to Wyoming. What this has done is just really opened the conversation for partnerships with ranchers, the university, tech people. We've been working on a, the, the rising issue and exploding issue, if you will, of food fraud in the food supply chain. There's more fraud in food than there is in the illegal trade of small arms and illicit drugs. It creates a new conversation for the state of Wyoming. It also creates new interest in venture capital coming into projects like this. Processing this technology is going to allow us to be certified to ship beef anywhere in the world, where in the last years that we've sold, we're only certified to ship inside the United States. It gives Wyoming the ability to now brand their beef. So we're going from having a bunch of people kind of doing their own thing a little bit here and there to try and creating a system that people can use to know that this came from Camp Stool Ranch or from Pumpkin Buttes Ranch or from the Person Ranch. The highest quality, best tasting beef in the world comes out of a, a five-state area, which actually Wyoming happens to be in the center of it and has the best. People that are eating Wyoming-produced beef know the quality and the value that was put into raising that beef. I hope I'm standing here a year or two years from now and saying, you know, we've learned a lot, uh, we've got a long ways to go, but this has helped us be here on the long term.